Hi, welcome to today's video. This is Sharon here at Chipper Farm and I'm here with Pixie and I want to show you that we are in need of administering the copper bolus again. According to my records, over here in yellow, I gave the copper bolus um, the 28th of June of this year, and now it is the end of September, so that really only lasted four months. This was also the uh, month that she got attacked by the dog, so that's why there's so much on the calendar for her. And I want to show you her coat. See down here, it's nice and solid, gold colored, but up here it's getting all lighter. That means she is in need of copper. And her tail doesn't look too bad, but it is starting to thin out. And that's called a fish tail because it only looks like a fish tail that's left. And so, again, it's only been four months, but apparently she needs it. Maybe my well water is actually taking the copper out of her faster than that copper bolus was uh, supposed to. So I'm going to administer that. I have the balling gun right now and I'm going to use peanut butter in it and I thought of a phone stand so I'm going to use this and set this up and maybe you'll actually get to see me try to administer it to her. These are the copper bolus I use. They're from the company called Ultra Cruise on uh, San Juan Ranch. You can buy them online. You can see this is going to where it's going to push the pill out. So you just put that all the way in the back. Get some peanut butter in there. And this is the copper wire particles inside the capsule. Alright, this is never fun, but we'll give it a try. the Nutri Drench.
Good girl. That's a good girl. You're all done. Good boy. You can see that his coat is a lot lighter on top also than compared to the color on the bottom. He's needing copper also. His tail's still pretty full though. So, this should be fun with him. Chipper, I have to do is he has some forming. It's all starting to grow inward. See, it, see that they're loose, so I gotta cut those. We got most of it off. That just pulled off. That one pulled off too. The boys don't normally like the Nutri Drench. I know, it's hard for you to get your head through, but it fits. Go on. Come on. Come on. Doesn't it fit? I thought it fit. Oh, boy. This is not going to be fun. Uh -uh. 
Come over here, baby. Now she's normally like a dark espresso color and you see that light spot coming in that shows that she's in need of the copper bolus she starts to get lighter by turning copper colored all right and I don't know what Max does he's a white goat so I just treat him when I treat everybody else See, look at her tail. See, it's a little bit thin. It's a little fish-tailed. That's another sign that they need the copper. All right, thank you for watching. Hopefully this will help you recognize the signs of copper deficiency in your goats, and you can take care of it before it gets too bad. The copper also helps the goats fight worms. Please subscribe if you haven't already, and hit the notification bell so you know when I put out new videos. Thanks. I'll see you next time at Chipper Farm. This one came from Max and this one came from Chipper. When I tried to cut them, I twisted and they just popped off. You see the cut marks in it? And it popped off, which is nice. See how sharp this one was? Growing backwards and pointed.